guys, it's Kima and welcome back to my channel. But I've been dipping and dabbing into different products and trying new things and I think I found some pretty good stuff. I've been looking for a new foundation. You guys know that I've been using the L'Oreal True Match and I love that foundation but the thing about it, it doesn't last as long like I still get oily in my T-zone area. So I was looking for something that would come back that and that will give me like a flawless finish. So I picked up the Clinique Acne Solutions Liquid Foundation. Now this is supposed to be good for oily skin and also acne prone skin, which is, I'm like a combination of both. I went to Sephora, canceled with me, we had went to the mall. And um, she went to Macy's real quick. And then when she came back to Sephora, I, you know, I was still swatching on my fingers and stuff cause I was trying to swatch myself so I can get the right color and stuff. And she came back, she was like, well, if you make a purchase of, I think it was $27 or so, you'll get a free sample or like a bag of free samples or something like that. So I was like, er, wait a minute. Yeah, I had quickly went out of Sephora, walked down to Macy's and picked up this foundation. This one, I have to use like a SPF with it. And also this has salicylic acid in it, which is really good for acne prone skin. And I'm in the color number 18, and this is the Fresh Cream Caramel. It came with this cute bag with some free goodies in it. And then it came with this other little cute little bag inside. So I was like, okay, so I got a cute little set right here. The Clinique's Dramatically Different Moisturizing Lotion Plus. The Clinique's Long Lasting Glossware, which looks like this. It got the gloss on one end and then it got the lipstick on another. This little eyeshadow palette. I have no clue what that says. I don't know if it says Lulu or Lala DK for Clinique. I don't know. Looks like this. I haven't tried the eyeshadows yet, but I have been dipping in the blush, so I like that color. This is the Clinique Moisture Surge Extended Thirst Relief. It's like a gel type of formula. Looks like that. And then hopefully y'all can see this. Look at that. Like it's it's moisturizing, but it's not, it doesn't leave like any type of residue behind. And it's not like oily. It's like a gel, so it absorbs into the skin. Like look at that, it's not like really shiny or anything, but my skin feels amazing. I had to pick up these. And if you don't know what this is, you need to get you some. This is the LA Girl Pro Concealer. It's the HD High Definition Concealer. I got it in Cool Tan, Toast, and pure beige cool tan i use this one a lot because i've been concealing a lot lately i don't like to conceal but like i said i've been dealing with this biotin and it has caused your girl face to look hideous i picked this one up the toast because i've been getting into a lot of contouring lately and this helps to slim down my face because i'm also in the process of losing weight so i'm trying to chisel out that face especially for like different events and stuff so this come in handy for that and this pure beige one I use it as a highlight now I don't really like to highlight underneath my eyes I'll do it sometimes but every time I do that like it always enhances my fine lines up under my eyes and I don't like that it tend to look dry looking so I don't know I'm gonna work out a certain formula for it just to see but then I got something coming in the mail that I kind of want to reveal to you guys so I'm just wait on that but in the meantime, I have been highlighting, but I don't do it as much because I don't really like it. But when I do, I use this here. Now, one step that I've been doing lately before I put on any type of lipstick is using this Shea Moisture Lip Exfoliator. And it looks like this. And I just run it across my lips and it has like these little grains in there that helps to exfoliate your lips. So I just go across my lips a couple of times and then I'll take my finger moisturize my lips or whatever you know make sure i'm working the product in my lips leave it on until i'm ready uh to apply my lipstick which is after i get done with my makeup i just take a warm towel wipe it off and then i apply my lipstick and it's been working wonders i'm in love with this something that came in and changed my life so i picked up the anastasia beverly hills brow wiz and when i tell you this was the best pickup that i ever picked up that makes sense. I don't know, it made sense to me. The kicker part that I love about this one is the brush that's on here. But I feel like it just gets every brow hair that you have. 
and put it in its place. I love how thin the pencil is on this so I get a precise line every time. I got the color dark brown and I actually have it on my eyebrows now. So my eyebrows been looking pretty on point because of this. And also I've been using a cool tan to kind of outline and clean up the brow. So these two together work hand in hand. Apparently the next one is a little bit cheaper than this one because this one was $18. And I, I'm not sure how much the next one costs, but when I get my hands on it, I'll do a separate video and compare. So another thing that has completely changed my life, I know I said another thing had changed my life, but this one I think was it. This one is the Benefit Lash Roller. Oh my goodness. Now I was already on a mission. Like I knew what I was going into Ulta for and it was for this right here. And I had a random customer come up to me and told me that I need to try this. Like how amazing it was. But little did she know I had already came up in there to pick this up. So y'all when I um got in that mirror did this and said swoop Baby, you couldn't tell me nothing. Man, I was up in ultra like ba -ba bam, 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 like just flapping them, flapping my wings. I could have flew away up out of there. I just came up to you just batting, like just batting. You would have thought I had an eye problem or something, but I just wanted you to see these lashes like they was on point. And I was just like, uh-uh, I got to pick this up. And I was going to pick up two of them, but I was like, slow your roll. It's still going to be there. You don't even need a eyelash curler. This is amazing. That cuts out a step. Now, I wanted to pick this up because when I'm on set and different things, this is like what I need right here. This is this is what I need. I need something that's gonna last all day. I need something that's gonna be quick and efficient. This is quick and to the point. I'm gonna do a uh, demo on this and you'll see how my lashes look. But when I tell you this like opens up your eyes, like it just makes you look more alive and you don't need an eyelash curler, like who does that? Benefit, benefit, I love you. Thank you. Ooh, but let me tell you one thing though. You do need to put this on like at a slow pace. Like don't be rushing. If you're rushing out of the house or you got to be somewhere, don't use this because you have it all on top of your list. It has happened to me. So I suggest if you're going to use this, take your time, find the time to do it and just go in. And that way you don't have to worry about doing so much cleanup, especially if you have eyeshadow on. You don't want like all the black specks and stuff on your eyeshadow or have to redo all of your work over. So just take your time when using this. That's the only like default I have about this. I tried this baby right here. Now y'all know I be using my witch hazel and stuff. And I didn't purchase this. Um, I had got this from a previous event and I just decided to try it out because everybody and their mama been talking about this lately. So I'm like, well, let me try it too to see what all the hype about. But this is the Pixie Skin Treats and it's their Glow Tonic. And then, like I said, it has the aloe vera with the ginseng in it. And this stuff smells amazing. It cleans my face pretty good. I'll cleanse my face and then I'll go back over the cleanse with this. And then I go with the rest of my steps and my skin routine. So hair products, y'all know I couldn't forget about the hair products. And let me just tell you, when I pick this up right here, this this my new staple right here. This is my new leave-in conditioner. And this is by Shea Moisture. And it's the Jamaican Black Castor Oil. And it's the Strengthening, Growth, and Restore Leave-In Conditioner. And it has shea butter, peppermint, and keratin in it. It adds so much moisture to my hair. Like, I don't get it, but I like it. Like, I don't, I don't even want to get it, but I just want it to work. And that's what it do. It do what it say right here. About this hair. Yes, this is a wig. <laughs> I've been pretty much wearing it for the whole month of April and I've been getting good responses about this hair. Actually, people think it's my real hair. So I purchased this wig from my local beauty supply store and this is the Bobby Boss wig. It's in the color number two and it's the MLF23 Capri. It looks like this. Okay, so this is by Vita Fusion and it's a women's vitamins. I'm trying to work on this health kick right here. And I, I don't have a problem with taking like pills, or anything like that. Like, you know, my vitamins by pill form. But this right here, these are so good. Like, like I don't understand. Like, why y'all didn't make this when I was younger? Like, I don't know. Now, I say, take two a day. I'm gonna tell you one thing right now. That is super hard to do. But 
it can be done. And don't be looking at me like that. This is my second one, so I can't have no more. Although I wanna eat this whole thing right now. I don't know if I'll still be alive in a couple hours, so I ain't gonna do that. So I just got all the stuff that you need in your body to keep you moving, basically, and healthy. But um, these, these are good. Now, I, I'm warning you, they too good. So don't be in there just snacking on like they some candy or you got a sweet tooth and you just want one of these. Like that ain't gonna that ain't gonna work. So if you feel like you can't contain yourself with just two a day, don't get it. Just stick to the pill form. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If it's anything that you got questions about or something that you would like for me to try, especially like some for my skin that's good for oily skin. Also, if you got some favorites that you would like to share with us, please do. This is a sharing platform. So, you know, sharing is caring. And um, yeah, so share with the girl and also with the rest of the girls and also the dudes too. I think it's some dudes that be on the page too. So, you know, hey y'all. So make sure you follow me on my social medias. That's probably the best way that you can contact me. I try to do my best to connect with you guys through my YouTube channel by commenting and different things. But if it's something that you need to get to me like directly or you just need to ask me something like right on the spot and you need it down on that, like contact me through Instagram. I'm always on Instagram. And then I'm trying to get on this Twitter thing. I feel like I can answer people better through Twitter. But other than that, I guess I'll catch you guys in my next video. Yako Ki. Peace.